Growing up, one of the things that always stood out to me was that on school photo day, everyone wanted to be tall enough to stand on the top risers for the class photo. Even as grown-ups, we still sometimes do this in our staff photo. It's as if being tall enough to be on the top makes you special. But good things come in small packages. Think about it. iPhones, so small and so much power. Babies, so small and so cute. Or even an antibiotic. One tiny pill and it can save your life. You see, size doesn't matter. But to Julia, it kind of does. You see, she's shorter than everyone in her class. And not by just like an inch or two, but by almost half a foot. Ever since she heard her parents talking badly about her height, Julia hasn't been very confident. And this isn't going the way she was hoping middle school would start. But that's all gonna change this summer when Julia auditions for The Wizard of Oz and actually gets a part in the play. I'm sure you're thinking Dorothy, right? Scarecrow? Tin Man? Maybe just maybe the Wicked Witch? Nope. <laughs> Julia's height makes her perfect for one role. Munchkin. I know, she seems typecasted, but hey, she's going to be the lead munchkin dancer. That has to count for something, right? Well, as the rehearsals go on, Julia meets Olive, an adult with dwarfism, and she quickly is learning that being short doesn't mean that others look down on you. It just means that there's even more packed into a smaller space. Julia isn't ready to fade into the background. And that's a good thing, because her director has some big plans.